Lone Kane here, and this is Furfly. Don't panic, don't die. Furfly is a fantastic black and white world you traverse as a furry fly, moving and flying through a swamp. Well, the swamp. A place that is filled with hostile things around you. At first, it feels like a classic 2D arcade game. It gradually starts to become much more by creating a unique game that is transforming itself. And unique. That's it. I don't know, unique and and just don't feel right together. I suppose it's proper, but anyway. Transforming itself into a challenging adventure that gives you a sentiment of reward with each level you finish. Okay, so it look at this. This doesn't look like it's gonna transform into much. But hey. Let's play it. Oh, minimum requirements. Ha. Huh. Buy now, five dollars. Okay, it looks like it's Windows Mac or Ubuntu. Or Steam OS. Wow, it actually says Steam OS. I, this is the first time I've seen SteamOS in a minimum requirements. Anyway, we'll see you on the other side. And we're back with more Unity. Yay! For Fly by SMD Gaming Studio. Arcade, Infinity, Credits, or Exit. No options, that's good. Music, something about a shopping cart. Let's go to the arcade. Use arrow keys. Okay, I'm pressing the arrow keys and nothing. There we go. Something's happening now. Alright, so this is a... Ruffle copter type game going on. So I don't immediately die from touching things. I can press down to go down faster, but if I'm not doing something, I do start to float downward. So. I guess this was a Flappy Bird idea. I'm liking the music. But it has ends. It's not it's just continuous. Although there was a continuous mode. We'll probably check that out if I don't forget. I want to hit one of these. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. Wanted to see what the effect was. Oh, I have a time limit. In the upper left-hand corner, I was trying to figure out what that was. But it's a time limit. I wonder what happens if it runs to zero. Am I going to find out? Yes, I am. Because there's only ten seconds on this one. Four. Three. Two. One. I had a feeling that's what would happen. Alright. Now I know, now I know. Wait, those don't hurt me. I thought those were spikes. I can just bounce into those? Those are spikes, though. Okay, no problem. I got this next time. But yeah, we, uh... We. Why do I say we? What am I doing? What am I thinking? My thought has ended! Oh, right. Oh, it's gone again. Damn it. Ah, yes. They claim that this is much more than just some sort of obstacle course. I forget the exact words he used. But I'm... This is actually really good. Another good game on Ichio. So, let it be known that the indie devs, they can... Aw. Oh, I got there at zero seconds, you bastard. I didn't even let go of the up button, I don't think. I don't think. That sounded retarded. I do not believe I let go of the up button that first time, so I don't know. This is... They're definitely pushing you. Can I make it? Can I get it? Alright, I got it. Excellent. I wish there was scores for each level. Well, maybe there is, and I just don't know about it. But I have a feeling if I quit, I have to start over from the beginning. Like, there's no checkpointing. Or saving. Level 6. Yeah, I think we'll get to level 10, just to see if... I guess I don't have to. I was gonna say, maybe I'll get to level 10, just to see if things change up a bit. And clearly they do. He does say it starts out as a simple platformer, I think he called it. Why do I want to think he called it a platformer? Because this is definitely not a platformer. But yeah, it does say it becomes much more, and this is this is definitely more. The art style is great. I haven't been paying attention to the music, but now that I think about it, that music seems pretty bitchin'. I'll, I'll be quiet for a bit so we can listen to it. just to hear that splat sound effect. So yeah, the music's pretty good. 
I wonder if I can get hit by that part. Nope, it just crushes me. I guess that makes sense. It looks like it's made of the same stuff the other stuff is. So I'm in a hostile swamp. So why are... <laughs> this is a very hostile swamp. I understand the, the thorns, but the saw blades are a little much. I don't know if I can get this one. I thought I did that as quickly as... I should be able to get it. Hold up as soon as I spawn, I'm holding up. Come over here, try not to get hit by that. Evade these things, which is pretty easy. Man, that is close though. Less than a second remaining by the time I get to that portal. And level 10, we've made it. To the grand finale. I missed. I find it interesting that every time you die, the saw blades and whatnot, rem they don't reset. Which means every time I die, it's a different challenge. Slightly, but it is a different challenge. And then I figure we'll check out 11 because of course I will. It seems like 11 is where they'll change it up a bit. And they did. Very relaxing game. That's a little too tight for me. Because I'm pretty much going to have to hold down this whole time. Ah. In order to make the time limit. But it, actually, there's 20 seconds. Maybe he gives a little bit of leeway for this one. I say he. It could, it could easily have been a female developer. Or a team. But I grew up in an age where... If we don't know... If it's male or female that did the thing... We just default to male. Which... I still think is okay. It's not PC anymore, and it's like, oh, you should say his or her. You know what? Those people can go fuck themselves. I'm gonna say him, he, his, or I will say her, she. I mean, why? Why does it have to be his or her? We don't have a word for it, and I understand we don't want to eliminate the possibility of female, blah, 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 or male, blah, 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 for that matter. My take on the whole situation is, if you want to say he, say he. If you want to say she, say she. And if you want to say he or she... What? Oh. And if you want to say he or she, that's fine too. But it sounds like crap on paper. You don't ever want to say he or she. Well, he or she is going to the mall today, and then he or she went to... No. He went to the mall today, and then he went to the Dragon Ball Z convention. Or, she went to the mall today, and then she went to the Dragon Ball Z convention. Wow, it sounds so much better when we don't say he or she. Ugh. <laughs> I'm, not a, I'm not trying to say, oh, we need to keep it masculine. I'm just saying, just use one or the other. If we decide to come up with a name that we like, then or a word that we like that represents both, we'll do that. They're like, Schlee and Schlur, like Futurama said. But I don't really like that either. If anything, I would say she with the S in parentheses would be a good default, but then you have problems with like the him versions, which don't really exist. Well, him, her does. Him, her, he, she, his, is there hers? I don't know. That's... All right, that's it. I don't remember what the name of this game is, but I'm sure it'll be in the description, or better yet, I'll hit escape and remember I want to do infinity mode. All right, so I'm guessing infinity mode just means there's no top. Hello. That's like a little snake shooting little bombs at me. That's adorable. No, don't shoot me with your bombs. Wow, that is a ball, a spiked ball on a chain in a swamp. That's what that is. So this hasn't been too challenging. Does it get more challenging as I go up, or is it just simply random? I've already seen one of those. I feel like I'm, I'm starting over. I still feel like I'm starting over. Yeah, I think it's just a random... Hey. <laughs> I wanted to touch him. Oh. Well, that's different. And these ones explode when they hit the end. Maybe the other ones did too, and I just wasn't paying enough attention, but hey. Okay, so there is a number over there on the left. 
2.4. So I guess it's a distance thing. So this is this is where the real Flappy Bird begins. Actually, I never played Flappy Bird. I played Rafflecopter. Rafflecopter is my age group. Ha! <laughs> uh, dating myself. So... This is becoming less exciting, because I'm no longer talking about he, she, schler, schler, kl, 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 Yeah, let me know what you guys think about my English conundrum in the comments below. Or you could talk about this game. This game looks neat. I'm enjoying it. It's pleasant. I think I might enjoy it a little bit more on a phone. I probably won't play this again, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. But after we finish this, I'll leave the game. Oh, I splatted. I splatted. Let's take a look at the... I want to know what this is. Merchandise. Ha! <laughs> they have a store. Our furry little friend. PC, Android, and Windows. Okay, so it is on Android. Let's go back to Furfly. So, it is available... Oh, right, that's right. It was Windows, Mac, Ubuntu, and SteamOS. For $5... $5 is a little pricey these days for a game like this, but I think it's worth it. I think developers that make games that work... The controls flow well, the art is great, the sounds are great. These people deserve our, uh, a decent pay. Not 99 cents. $5 is good. I'm happy with $5. $5 or more. If you want to pay more, go for it. That's Furflay. Don't panic, don't die. Thank you all for watching. Enjoy.